In Chinese medicine, problems with the knee reflect back to the kidney energy. When the kidney energy and your adrenals get weaker, the knees will weaken. And that's why we have in language weak need person. It's a person whose weak need is somebody lacking will. A strong kidneys is, is, is equal to a strong will. So actually to treat something like a knee problem like you have, it, it's not just the knee. You have to treat the kidney, you have to treat your acidity. So it incorporates a whole naturopathic, my naturopathic medical protocol, the full approach. Treating the kidneys is, must be one of the most difficult things there is. Changing one's kidney energy and one's will. There's not a, there is no, not a supplement or a pill that can do it. It's a deep thing. In, term, in terms of sodium bicarbonate, I would probably make the same recommendation I would to a cancer patient. You need to take enough every day, orally, and through baths, to get your urinary pH up to 8 in the morning. Your first urine flow, you do the test, and you want that at 8. And you want to get it there for about two weeks, about that level. Then you can take a break from the bicarbonate for a week. The magnesium, as I said, you need to saturate your body with it. There are different ways of taking it uh, orally and different forms orally on the body itself and the legs and the knee and having massage using it transdermally, taking baths with it, taking enough orally until it gives you diarrhea. Then you know you're taking enough in terms of orally. After two weeks of intensive magnesium intake, you have a, a, some sort of feeling for how it might change your situation, how it might change your experience of your knees and how they might strengthen or become more softer, more flexible. So there's not a fixed dose, meaning you need to take as much as you can and probably then you're still not going to take enough.